Okay, welcome to another episode of Facility Talk with Olarun Tadios. On today's episode, the topic is can a single man or woman do surrogacy? Can you venture into a surrogacy arrangement? No, or what if I am single? What if you are single? What if? Can you do surrogacy as a single person? Okay, so let me get down, or before I get down into answering the question, uh, I will define what surrogacy is. Okay, so surrogacy is when another woman helps you to carry your pregnancy, and uh, this other woman is called, usually referred to as a gestational carrier, and um, she doesn't just get pregnant by sex, no. It doesn't happen that way. So she she gets pregnant via IVF, meaning that your ex and that of your male partner, or maybe a donor sperm or a donor egg, you know, can be fertilized and the embryos will be generated and transferred into the surrogate mother's womb so that she carries the pregnancy and give birth to the baby and the baby will be yours at delivery okay that is what surrogacy is all about so the question back to my question can you do surrogacy as a single man as a single woman yes you can as a single woman it means that you are not married or you know probably maybe you have a partner or maybe you don't even have a partner and all you just want is to be a mother is to be a parent Yes, you can, you can do IVF if you want to carry your pregnancy. You can carry your pregnancy using donor egg. And if you don't want to carry your pregnancy, you can use a surrogate mother to have your baby, even as a single parent. Yes, the, the likely question would not be, oh, okay, what happened if I use a donor sperm? Who will be the father of the baby? Okay, so that question is what you are going to ask yourself. So there was a video I watched and the person said there is a difference between a dad and a father. Having a father, anybody, anybody can be a father to your, to your child, you know, but you know, so if you want to have a dad, okay, maybe that is another different thing. But in this arrangement, you are the dad and you are the mom. All you need is a father and anybody can be a father. So, so far the person agrees with you. Okay. So, so as a single woman, you can. And as a matter of fact, I usually encourage a single um, ladies to start the journey on time because, you know, um, biological clock ticks very fast on women. By the time you're 39 and above, the quality of the hair has reduced, has reduced drastically. Getting pregnant naturally will become very difficult. And, you know, I quite understand for some women, who you know wants to do things rightly they want to get married first then let the baby comes yeah if you are of that school of thoughts i'm not going to say you're wrong but it's just that um, it's something to consider that you know by the by the, or you ask yourself the que this question by the time uh, mr Wright comes um will i be able to still you know use my eggs to have my baby if you're okay with alternative option then you know that will not really bothers you but if you are not okay with alternative options and by alternative options what i'm talking about is using donor egg you know then that means you need to start earlier as soon as you see that you 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 clock uh, 35 then you know the plan to either um have your eggs um, um, freeze or probably do surrogacy to have your baby then you know it's only time to have a baby you can always explain to your husband later in future oh, you have a child through surrogacy it's not a crime okay so so whichever one you think um you can cope with whether it's freezing or whether it's to carry the pregnancy yourself using donor egg or, or whether it's just to um, use a surrogate mother using your egg. I've, I, 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 I've worked with a lot of fantastic single ladies 
using donuts, spam, you know, and yeah, they, they hold up to it with their big chests and they are happy mothers and very, very happy parents. Okay. So this is achievable for single, for single ladies. It's something to think about. Like I said, knowing fully well that, um, you don't have the whole time reproductively. Okay. And for men, why not? Why not? And, um, since single ladies can do it why not you as well and honestly i have a lot of guys a single dad um that have done surrogacy with us same thing applies anybody can can be a mother okay but you are the mom and you are the dad okay so you should get someone to be the mother and you know, that would do in um probably when you want to get your nigeria international or nigeria passports and you know so that would just be okay okay so so why not you can you can have a baby even if you're not married you can be a parent even if you're not married sometimes ago i wanted to work with uh, another doctor and um and one of the condition he placed me or he put before me was that um, he doesn't work with um, singles. That, that fertility is a couple thing. Ooh, well, I know some school of thought are still, you know, thinking that way, but fertility or infertility has gone beyond a couple thing. And it's high time we start telling ourselves the truth. Some people don't want to get married. Some people just want to remain the way they are. Some people are not attracted to opposite sex. Some people, whichever one it is, you they are all available. It's only if we want to start, you know, telling ourselves lies that, you know, you cannot deny anybody legally cannot deny their right, them of their right to procreate, to have babies. It is their right. It is their, it is their right. You can't. I'm very sure most school of thoughts are, ling are ling lingering towards my, my, my direction that anybody could be a parent. You don't have to be married. You don't have to um, have a partner before you can have a child. Donor hex can be used, donor sperm can be used, both donor hex, donor sperm can be used to have your baby, and it is not illegal. Okay, IVF has come to has come to stay, it has been in existence for a very long time, and a lot of new innovations are coming up, and you know, uh, we should uh, hope be opened to receive all these new medical ideas and um, technologies okay so that is that is it for today i hope you get it that you can be a parent regardless of your marital status so it's nice to have you it's nice to um oh, it's nice having you on today's program thank you for watching uh, for more inquiries please kindly comment below or you can call the number showing on your screen. We are also fully available on Instagram at Meet Surrogate Mothers. So, or you know, you can also have us on WhatsApp. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you can get notification as soon as we post a video. Thank you and God bless.